Eight and a half million people watched that last night. I mean, have you any idea of what the reaction would be to that? I, I knew it was going to be big because uh, it's quite a big thing that happened in the show, but it's, it's gone nuts today. Just the media reaction to it's been crazy. And, and what has happened, I mean, today? Yeah, it's just there have been a lot of uh, comments on Twitter. I think it's built up last night after the show. But when you did that, that was in the heat of the kitchen. I mean, do you regret that? I mean, were you actually quite angry? Um, I was more frustrated um, and it was just at the heat of the moment. And you're, you're in the zone the last sort of half hour of the show. I guess very tense. So he had gone through all this thing about you, you bit your sponge for the Alaska, mm. baked Alaska, and then you had your ice cream in the freezer. And Diane took your ice cream out the freezer. Now, was it her freezer? Uh, there, were, there was a group of freezers we're all using. So you had no idea that your ice cream had been dumped out the freezer? No, I didn't, no, unfortunately not. Now, of course, I mean, Diane had subsequently left the show and that was nothing to do with anything that mm. happened on that because she wasn't well. But the, the tension in these things is phenomenal, isn't it? It is, because you've been in the tent yourself. Yeah. The pressure in the tent's really huge and it's very different from baking at home. And no, I don't hold any grudge against Diane. Um, I think it was just done in the heat of the moment. But, but, your, but your ice cream was obviously completely destroyed, but you couldn't have put it back, because basically what they were saying was you should just have made a fist of it, you should have staged, you should have popped your yeah. egg white on top and blowtorched it. Yeah, I tried to um, uh, but do was, something with it. Did you flounce it. off? Uh, no, because just the state of it, you saw the state it was in, it just completely went. And to try and get meringue onto that, I didn't think it was But I mean, was this, were you a novice baker or are you actually a very good baker? Um, I'm a keen baker. I don't know about a good baker, um, but I'm a keen baker. I like so, baking. So uh, you brought something uh, in with you. Mm -hmm. Tell me, what, what, what's the genesis of this? Where did this come from? Um, There's a cake I baked for the first audition for the show. So it's a course. So it must have been very good. Can I have um, some? Yes, you can. It's a courgette. Uh, so it's a courgette and what? Courgette, lemon and poppy seed cake. Right. And this was good enough to get uh, Mary Beard, ex uh, Ma uh, Mary Berry, maybe we got Mary Beard excited as well, but got Mary Berry excited. Um, yes, so and, you know, if you had actually held your nerve, you might have gone all the way with this. But you didn't, unfortunately. And what do you think about this uh, uh, Bring Ian Back campaign? Yeah, it's, it's gone crazy. It really built up very fast after the show yesterday. It's bringing him back and justice for Ian. Oh, and yeah, it's been really nice support, um, but it's been crazy. It's really just built, built up overnight. And do you think you might get back? Um, Somehow, sometime? You have, to, you have to watch next week. So tell me about this, because this is your own recipe. Courgette, but this is a, a, a lemon drizzle cake, but you put something special in it. Yes, um, so it's gridded courgette, so it's quite like a carrot cake, it's quite moist. Um, and I've added poppy seeds for texture, and it's got ground almonds to keep it quite moist inside. So this is a, this is a signature dish. It is, yes, a I bake a lot. And, and what do you think you're going to be uh, doing when you've got the day job going, because you're yeah. a site manager, a building site, so yeah. are they all behind you? Yeah, they're all behind me. I've got a lot of support and a lot of, yeah, they, they get a lot of ribbing at work Well, as I have well. to say, this is something for you to put up at work tomorrow. This is uh, the Sun's headline. There we go. The Sun says, baking bad. Dirty Die quits off Alaska pudding row. But you have spoken to her since, have you? I have spoke, I spoke to her this morning. And I feel like and is she okay? Of, yeah, she's fine, yeah. She's fine. Well, thank you very much indeed for coming on and congratulations yes. for creating such a stir. Thank you.